In July 1941, Italy mounted a daring raid on Malta's defenses. La Decima, a highly trained elite unit of the Italian Navy, prepared to wreak havoc on the Royal Navy's fleet stationed in the Grand Harbor. To aid them in the attack, they brought with them a new and top secret weapon, the human torpedo. We tend to think of these elite underwater frogmen, special forces units as being a kind of British or an American invention, you know, Navy SEALs, special boat service. Actually, it's likely that the Italians got there first. They operated small explosive boats that could be rammed against larger shipping, um, and also human torpedoes, which are effectively a, a conventional torpedo modified so that frogmen can ride it into a harbor, place explosive against a ship, and then seek to escape on the same torpedo. Heavily armed forts overlooked the breakwaters at the entrance to the Grand Harbor, and the space between them was blocked with metal nets designed to withstand torpedoes and submarines. The crux of the plan was to cut a breach in the metal net that was under the bridge. Covertly rigging explosives to the net was the job of the human torpedo. The blast would act as a cue for the rest of the Italians to speed under the bridge in their explosive boats and attack the British fleet moored in the harbor. The reason for them needing to be quiet and stealthy is this large concentration of lookout posts and gun emplacements. So the Italians were attacking right under the noses of the defenders. Just before dawn, the attack force gathered at their meeting point near the entrance to the Grand Harbor. A human torpedo was sent in to deploy its charge, but after a long and tense wait, there was no explosion. In desperation, Aristide Carabelli, a dedicated Italian officer, sprang into action. He drives his fast explosive boat directly at the bridge. Sacrificing himself, Carabelli smashed into the bridge, disappearing in a huge fireball. Hearing the explosion and assuming their path was now clear, his fellow attackers raced towards the bridge. The force of this massive explosion blows one of the sections of the bridge right off its foundation, and this literally lands and blocks the channel into the harbor. Stuck at the impassable bridge, the elite Italian unit have nowhere to hide. The searchlights come on, the sea is illuminated, and literally, it turns into a turkey shoot. It was a devastating failure for the Italians. 15 men were killed and 18 captured. Not a single member of La Decima made it home from the disastrous mission.